Police dash cameras capture the moments after they say 19-year-old Victoria Drag Camp crashed into the Fox River in downtown Waukesha earlier this month. Officers say she was drunk and took out a woman's walker sitting on a nearby bench. Did you get hit? Oh, she hit me. Are you okay? Do you need an no. ambulance? Do, uh, I'm going to go. Just to... have a sit on the bench and we'll come meet with you in a so second. Drunk. Okay. Car was going zigzag. Leslie Silvernail lives nearby and was outside that night when the car nearly hit him too. He says he jumped into the river and pulled the driver out of the sinking car. Police took her into custody. What made you decide to jump in the river? And I didn't even think it just something I had to do. The wreck is just a few hundred feet from where a truck went into the Fox River in May. Police say at least five vehicles have now plunged into the river in this area since 2013. We need a barrier there to let them know that they need to slow down and there's no road there. The city is planning a traffic study to see if barriers are needed at that intersection. Neighbors also worry about this stretch of Carina Boulevard, where they say people are driving too fast. These zoom around here at least 35, 40 miles an hour, just squealing, yeah, around the bend. Yeah, and I'm afraid that we'll be sitting here they're going to go up to and someone's going to get really hurt. Someone's going to get killed. God forbid. Ben, you hear the concerns right there, but what do first responders say about this area? Well, Patrick, we talked to the fire department. They say that it is rare that they have to make water rescues here on the Fox River. They say that that stretch of road is fine, that it's most important for those drivers to be careful. Patrick. Ben Wagner reporting live in Waukesha tonight.